Don't blink. It's your boy Ink, freshly out of the throne. Because I'm doing all because I'm having a wonderful day on this 8th November 2024. Happy birthday, Selin. Happy birthday, Selin. It's your birthday. I'm my best friend. Copyrighted it already. Today we're reviewing a movie. That uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I fucking just watched it and it was amazing. The Family. So the Family is a movie with Robert De Niro. I have a problem with the other actress, actor's name. You'll have to forgive me. Um, there's also... Uh, I have to check. Because there's, there's a couple of big names in that movie. But I mean, ultimately speaking, what is The Family about? Well, The Family is an amazing movie. Right? <laughs> now, they pick a family. And if you know Robert De Niro, he did a shit ton of... Um, Gangster movie. A shit ton of gangster movie. And uh, <laughs> the, the, the wonderful thing with Robert De Niro is it's something, not necessarily a typecast, they do it with every typecast, but I gotta say, I got a special something for a gangster movie with Robert De Niro. From Goodfella to The Casino to The Irishman, which was brilliant. To well, I think that's enough, right? Well, let's not forget family. So the family is about a. Uh, it's really fucking weird, because the guy clearly has this love for gangster movie, right? He he really likes Casino, uh, the Irishman that was three hours long. He plays the role of a snitch, and that snitch is being moved around, right? And that snitch, it, it's not really look in any situation as snitch. It's not necessarily looking in the most positive fashion, but then again, Robert before that did a movie called uh, Grandpa, Dirty Grandpa, and he said the N-word, so. <laughs> I think even the snitch is, a, is a, a step forward. But the movie is actually beautiful. The movie is fantastic. So, um, how can I say that? It's, it's, you know, I'll be completely honest. I have the utmost respect for, I'll be completely honest. I have the utmost respect for gangsters, for mafia. Grew up watching The Sopranos. Listened to the audiobook of, because it's a book, right? The Godfather, multiple times. Goodfellow was my favorite movie. Why did I like the mafia so much as a kid? Hmm? Because the mafia had a sense of honor. The mafia has a sense of, there's rules, right? There's rules. La Buonota. Even Sopranos. <laughs> you can hate Tony, but he was following rules. You can hate Chrissy. He was following rules. You can hate Polly. Well, fuck Polly. <laughs> but, 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 we're getting away from it. Um, the, there's rules. In the Mafia, what is really cool is it's a way of life. But in the Mafia, weirdly speaking, and you can agree or disagree, but the Mafia has almost this soldier system. See, to a certain degree, the Mafia has ranks. Private. Hmm? General. Hmm? Admiral hmm? and Caporal. Now, I might have got that not wrong. I'm Canadian. The army over here is a boot. Not great. A boot. Uh, sorry. But yeah, so um, there's, there's this very military um, faction or fashion to Mafia. And Robert De Niro's character is a victim of that. Not a victim of the fact that he was a soldier, but a victim of the fact that he was serving a purpose without realizing who he was. So the movie is about him looking for who he is. And the reality is kind of cool because... <sighs> I mentioned Tony Soprano. Tony Soprano. One of the characters that I love in Tony Soprano, Soprano is Christopher. Chrissy. Fucking love Chrissy. I love Chrissy. One of my favorite characters. You deserve better, Chrissy. If you were, even if you were a fucking drug addict. But... You did Adriana wrong, my dude. Wrong. She, fuck, she was hot. And, uh, oh, dang. Adriana, whoo, baby. Young Ink had a field day watching re reruns of a Soprano. But again, we're running out of subject. So Chrissy, right, kind of wanted to write a book. Now, there was two reasons why Chrissy wanted to write a book. First of all, it wanted to be something more than just a mafia guy, right? Second of all, it was to a tone, right? It was to a tone. Now, Robert De Niro is an older age, but that feeling of atonement is really cool. And you can say, well, the soprano doesn't have anything to do with the family, and you'd be completely right. However, remember how we started this video? I remember, I was five minutes ago. That's not that hard. 
mafia as a system, right? So in the mafia, what we, what we have that is phenomenal is that you want to atone, so you want to write a book. But the book, you cannot write it, right? So you have the, the main character of Robert who's looking at himself. But it's also how his life affected the, the family. You want to know the most brilliant part of the family? You want to know the masterpiece of why this movie is so good? There might be mafia, but they're family. At most, in most family and mine, the patriarch is the leader of the family. In this movie, the leader is the patriarch. So we have the wife, who's a mob wife. She acts like a mob wife, right? But she's also a mother. I wish we had more scene with her because she's, she's an amazing character. She's an amazing character. She's, she's very like, how can I say that? For some reason, she reminds me of Carmela, but a better Carmela. A, a lot better than Carmela. The Carmela. Sorry, I'm tired. I did a lot of video today. Um, then, you have the kids. And I believe the kids are the picture perfect. See, the movie The Family, it follows, it follows the... How can I say that? It follows the cliche family. So a son, a daughter, and a wife. The son, of course, daddy's boy, wants to do like his daddy. So when he goes to school and he gets bullied, then he said, you know what? Fuck you. I'll make a, a business out of it. So he started doing business. He started doing deal. Just like his father will. And the daughter. is super sad. She's a classic daughter. She's a classic teenage daughter. Falls in love with an older man. Older man takes advantage of her. There you go. It's a story we saw before. It's a story we saw today. It's a story we'll saw tomorrow, next week, next month. The Family is a really good family movie. Is it a great mafia movie? Eh, not really. But a great family movie. Because you know what? You know what? No matter how different they were, no matter how, many, how much they fought, we're still there at the end together. And that's the family. Beautiful movie. Simple movie. Great job, Robert.